That was so much fun. Where, where did they all go? Ah! Hey, Heart TV viewers, I'm Max Davis, and alongside with me is the one and only Catherine Montenegro. Catherine, can you believe it's already Friday, November 3rd? Time sure flies, Max. And speaking of flying, today's theme is going to take us under the sea to explore some incredible creatures. That's right, folks. It's National Jellyfish Day. That's right, Catherine. Get ready to dive into the fascinating world of jellyfish. But before we get into all that jelly goodness, Catherine, how has your week been? Oh, you know, Max, just trying to stay afloat with school, and I'm excited for this weekend. How about you? Totally get you there, Catherine. School can be a real ocean of challenges, especially comp sci. But hey, we're here to make friends, and Friday's awesome for everyone. And I'm looking forward to the weekend, too. I might even find some time to visit the beach and see if I can spot any jellyfish. That sounds like a cool plan, Max. But speaking of jellyfish, I heard we have some amazing stories lined up for today's show. So, folks... Don't swim away! Today's Heart TV episode is definitely going to make a big splash, like me in the bathtub. Please stand for the pledge. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Get ready to walk down that red carpet, because now it's time for Spotlight on the Arts. Hey Hart, I'm Mr. Bailey, I'm the band director. I oversee the instrumental music program, I'm the advisor for Color Guard, and I also teach music technology. If you're interested in being part of any of our spring programs, such as concert band, jazz band, or drum line, please email me or stop by my office in the band room, R2. To get things started, I'd like to announce our Performing Artist of the Week. Congratulations goes to... Spencer Monroe! Spencer is a great trumpet player and a fantastic leader. Congratulations, Spencer. So this Saturday at College of the Canyon Stadium, the Heart Regiment will be hosting their 39th annual Rampage Marching Band Competition. You do not want to miss this exciting event. And if you've never been to a marching band competition, this is the show to watch. We'll host over 32 bands from all over Southern California. The event begins at 10 a.m. and ends at 8 p.m. Heart performs at 7, so come out and support us. If you're interested in volunteering at Rampage for community service hours, please email me for sign-up information. In just two weeks, on November 16th, 17th, and 18th, Heart's Theater Arts Department is performing their fall musical, Mama Mia. Be sure to see it at 7 p.m. right here in our beautiful Heart Auditorium. You can pre-order tickets for Mamma Mia on the Heart Theater website. Our award-winning Heart Dance Team is performing during halftime at the game on Friday. Come out and support the team. The dance team is also busy preparing for their annual Heart of the Holiday show on Saturday, December 9th. The annual show features many talented performers from local dance studios and schools, as well as our own amazing Heart Dance Team. You don't want to miss this. The Heart Show Choir is also planning Holiday House, which will open the weekend of December 2nd. Bring your friends and family and enjoy this very special holiday experience. This is Mr. Bailey's Spotlight on the Arts. Back to you, studio. Here's Parker with the weather. Good morning, Hart. Here's your weekend weather update. Today is going to be a high of 89 and a low of 48. It's going to be sunny. Tomorrow is going to be a high of 89 and a low of 49. It's going to be partly cloudy. And on Sunday, it's going to be a high of 82 and a low of 52. And it's going to be sunny. This has been Parker reporting for Hart TV. Back to you in the studio. Here's Nash, somewhere and someone in history. Welcome to another episode of Today in History. 
Today in history, in 1976, Jimmy Carter, winner of the Nobel Prize for Peace in 2002, was elected America's 39th president. And in the year 2000, first, the first residential crew, including one American and two Russians, arrived on the International Space Station. But, of course, we all know that the Russians would never allow us to win the space race if it ever happened again. Back to you guys in the studio. And now, the news. Get it? Because I'm a jellyfish. Football has their playoff game tonight at COC. The theme is Whiteout. Buy your tickets on GoFan. You must buy a ticket. You cannot get in with an ASB card. Kickoff is at 7. Calling all golfers, the 2024 Hard Boys Golf Trials will be held on Tuesday, November 14th at Vista Valencia Golf Course at 3.30 p.m. Bring your clubs and get your swing on. For more information, contact Coach Lindbergh in room Q3 or go to our website, hearthighgolf.com. Hey seniors, with the holidays upon us, it's easy to lose focus and fall off track. This is not the year to do that. Today's final year Friday lesson will give you tips to avoid senioritis and finish your high school journey strong. Head to the Class of 2024 Google Classroom to find out what to avoid as you complete your journey. Go for it. Clubs. Red Cross Club is meeting today at lunch in room S2. New members are welcome. Please come and join us. Future Coaches of America Club will be meeting today at lunch in room S5. Athletes are highly recommended to attend. The Astronomy Club meets today at lunch in room F32, exploring the universe one star at a time. Come and join us. Come to the Gardening Club today at lunch in room Q7. Green Thumbs and not-so-green thumbs are all invited. It's me, the vice president of this club, here to tell you that Film Club is meeting today at lunch in room F11. This is a mandatory meeting about STN. Don't forget to bring your slips. Come out to the Pokemon Go Club today at lunch in room T104. Gotta catch them all. I'm here to inform you that the Procrastination Club has decided once again that for the betterment of our people, we will procrastinate and postpone our meeting until probably next week. Your dictator truly says this all. Best wishes. Robotics Club meets after school today from 3 to 5 p.m. in room Q15. Speech and debate team meets on Monday at lunch in Miss Nishioka's room F43. Please attend. New members are always welcome. Red Cross is running a veteran's wish list drive through November 17th. Stop by room S2 to drop off your donations. They are looking for any new and unused hygiene products, such as shampoo, conditioner, toothpaste, toothbrushes, etc. Large items are preferred. Please refer to this flyer for the list of requested items. You can receive one service hour for every four items donated. Heart NHS, run by Cole Williams, is holding a canned food drive from November 6th to the November 17th. Drop off your donations in room C1 or K2. Students will receive one service hour per four cans donated, and a maximum of two hours can be earned by donating. Now it's time for today's Quote of the Day. Jellyfish are the ghosts of the sea. They are beautiful, but they can also be deadly. Anonymous. Well, that's it for our show. Don't forget to come out to our Real Deal fundraiser tonight at 6 in the auditorium. Have a great jellyfish day and, and stay classy, classy hard. Jellyfish. 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 Take some jelly, take some fish, look at that sandwich delish. Just make sure you don't eat jellyfish. 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 Jellyfish.